players in the sector say the abolition of the 17.5% value added tax on domestic airfares in 2017 has not influenced patronage. Well, according to them, the increase in patronage is not directly as a result of the removal of the tax. There's more in the following reports. In 2017, government abolished the 17.5% value-added tax on domestic airlines with the objective of increasing patronage. A year on after the abolition, Africa World Airline recorded a total of 347,996 passengers from Accra to Kumasi, Tamale, Takradi and Wa, whilst in 2019 there was a marginal increase to 442,404 passengers. Passion Air registered a total of 57,125 domestic travelers in 2018. However, in 2019 there was a major increase from 57,125 to 213,022, representing 272.90%. Data available to TV3 suggests there was an increase in passengers using the Accra Kumasi route from a 30% to 100% in domestic airlines with reference to Africa World Airline, Passion Air and Unity Air between 2018 to 2019. For the Tamale route, a 10% to 50% increase was recorded between African World Airline and Passion Air in the year under review, whereas for passengers using the Takradi route, there was a marginal 50% in increment in passengers' patronage. However, in 2019, there was a drop of 10% in domestic airlines to the WA route. Overall statistics shows a steady increase in passenger patronage in flights from Accra to Kumase, Tamale, Takradi and WA. Our sources who declined to speak on camera suggest the removal of 17.5% VAT on domestic airlines ticket has not contributed to the increase in patronage. On the contrary, they maintain the increasing cost of living coupled with current economic conditions slow the expected increase in the patronage of domestic airlines. The primary factor identified for the increase, according to industry experts, is a competition among airlines in pricing.